Well, win after win and run after run, the Park Rapids area softball team finds themselves off to a familiar start. Are more records in store for this ball club? Here's more from the Panthers. Success is no stranger for the Park Rapids softball team. Rewind to 2016 in a school record 23 wins, but just one shy of their goal to state. Something still in the back of their heads. Losing that game, it, yeah, it's fire. It makes us want it even more than we did last year. 15 wins later, this group of freshmen through seniors is playing with consistency and confidence. The cheering, the, the score and the runs, the play and catch together, the unity that they have is pretty cool. That unity is especially seen inside the batter's box one through nine, where the offense has produced 187 runs, a little over 12 a game. Everybody just like does their part, you know what I mean? Everybody's just all throughout our first leadoff hitter is good and all throughout the whole entire thing. Everybody is just perfect and everybody does their job. No easy out when facing this lineup up and down, but it's the top of the order that sets the tone. So speedy and they can get on base with pretty much anything. So it's really nice having that confident two first batters to get us started and then everything after that just follows. With all the runs though, it's easy to look past the defense or even the dominance in the circle by senior hurler Brooke Jerger. I actually get pretty nervous no matter who we're playing and I just have to think to myself that I just need to take one pitch at a time and if they do get a hit off me I have a great defense behind me. In 13 appearances she's only given up 15 runs for an ERA just north of two striking out 109 batters along the way. She has been a huge part in our success. Um, we wouldn't be where we are without her. Her tough mentality, her go-getter attitude. She's just always giving 110%. With solid offense, defense, and pitching, this team is ready for a deep postseason run. Definitely has been one of my biggest dreams ever since I was little. I feel like it's everybody's goal and dream to make it to the state. We had a successful and amazing season last year, but then to even top that this year with with more records and then to reach our final destination, yeah, I would be speechless. Well, the Panthers win again tonight. They're now 16-0, and so definitely keep an eye on them the next few weeks of the season. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.